What is going on guys, Assassin here with some more Final Fantasy XIV. In today's episode, we're actually going to be doing this um, quest, double dealing. <clears throat> we have to confront a Seven, so yeah. Where is he anyway? Uh, oh, oh wow, he's actually pretty far. Oh, well, we got a long walk ahead of us. So, does that say it? Does it say it was a level 8? Yeah. So we should, I mean, if we have to fight, we should be fine. We kill one of these along the way. They fuck it. Fuck hatchling. You're dead. There's a fate over here as well. I think we're just gonna just continue heading to the mission to the quest for now. Maybe we'll join in up to it later. What you doing over here? You seem sus. <laughs> Bloody hells, I'm I'm up the strat straight strat at whatever. <laughs> Without a paddle. Oh, right, we have to doubt him. Uh, what's this now? Stellworn sent you for the or oranges? Huh, so the old bugger had known all this time. Art. What does it matter anyway? Listen, you're one of all those goody goody adventure types, right? Go rescue me mates from those double dealing goblins. They're just over yonder by the bonfire. Okay. Level 12. A goblin mugger. Get the fuck out of there. Ow, what the fuck? Did he still fucking bombs at me? Fuck off. Fuck that. No, I ain't standing there. I'm not just gonna fucking stand there and like fucking hit me. Oh shit, we got another uh, teammate. Thank you, kind sir, purse, girl, thing. <laughs> I owe you one. Would have gotten away, my, away myself, myself, if not for serving, Severin shoving me aside. Yeah, Severin's a piece of shit. <laughs> Severin sent you ha the way he flew out of here. I was sure he'd soar us down the river. Get this last guy. If you hadn't come, my dodo would have been cooked. Mmm, cooked dodo. Really? That's what you're worried about right now? Cooked dodo. You saved me, mates, and for that I owe you. Suppose I should be ashamed I couldn't clean up my own mess. But a pirate knows no shame. I've no I've no qualms about going back on my word. I'm only giving you the sack because I like the cut of your jib. Take it to Oznine and send him my regards.
Ja. Alright, with this sack of oranges. Oh, it's lost your lamb. Oh shit, the lamb fights back, I forgot. I fucked up! It's dead. It's okay. Okay. I got you the oranges. What have we here? A delivery from Summer Ford Farms and as scheduled. Ha! Huh? There is a first time for everything. Well, look at that. Not a single one missing either. About the only thing not here are those bagmen, and I don't miss them one bit. Here's Stell War's payment in full. With you, I can trust it'll reach him. I gotta go all the way back. Ugh! I guess we can kill this lost lamb along the way. <laughs> Level 4, you're not gonna be shit to me. Sorry, buddy. Rats. Pretty sure the things above their head are for the hunting log thing. Oh, I got three animal skin. I'm just gonna sneak past all of you. Don't mind me. Okay. Almost back there. Talk to Stella Worm. See what he wants. The tiny man tricking trick trick Oh my god, I just realized I could have teleported. Fuck. Oh well. At least we got to kill some shit along the way. Okay. We're here. We did the thing. We talked to Severin. Back in one piece, there's a relief. How did you fare, Reef? I also got these oranges, I think. Uh, this is what I was aiming for. It looks to be all I was owed. <clears throat> Alright, though, I'd be telling you. you false if I claimed I had not held out more hope for Severin. I was even willing to overlook this off the top, but to sell us all short in favor of those gods forsaken goblins. <sighs> You'd do well to mind yourself round at two gill sheep. If he'd leave his own mates for dead, there's no telling what he'd do to you. I'd probably kick his ass. Oh my god. We look like some fucking cult member. <laughs> uh, 
think I might get the wrist the, the copper. Blast at this rate the crops will never be ready for harvest. If only we had a back a loom just a bit could send our stock soaring. I'll bet Ro 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 read pot wadi I don't know. <laughs> Knows where you might find some. Perhaps you might pay her a visit in the orchard. Okay. I'll see. I'm never not gonna break my leg jumping from that. Jumping that fun fucking from that. Hello? That guard cat's got a head of cabbage if he thinks I'm fetching him any black loam. But if you dare to pinch some from the cook pot, then be my guest. Just mind you don't get trampled upon by the whole rooted that dwell there. Once you've three bus. 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 bus Fuck's sake! Bus cells were take the black loom to Piff Walla at Tiller's Rev. You'll know what to do. Okay, we gotta go over here. I don't want any trouble. Yeah. Good old water. Not great. Oh, fuck. You're gonna keep following me? Thank God. Where the hell do I get up there? I'm kind of puzzled. Sneak past these guys if possible. Jesus Christ, that's a big boy right there. Oh god, he sees me. Oh, I'm so fucked. I just want the shit! Okay, we're gonna go and come back. We can't. Can't fucking fight that fucking behemoth of a fucking. What is that? A bull? Hey. Fucking run along. I just want my shit. Just want damn black loom. Of course. Just fucking course. Why am I not white? Target the motherfucker! Not great. But damn it. Ugh.
Ciao. There's no way to get past this guy. It's not an invalid market though, it's right fucking there! Okay, thank god. Get out of here. RUN! Bitches, I'm out! We're still chasing you? Not gonna lie. He has some real big dedication. Oh god, I wasn't even paying attention. Okay. Arg, even the weeds wither and die in this desolate dirt. We got your stuff. But a bit of this black loam ought to change all that. I haven't seen any in ages gathering black loam, not for the weak of will, nor the weak of stomach, eh? Ha ha ha. Oh, don't tell me, Gurkhan and a rough Tahu neglected to mention where black loams come from. Well, surely you figured it out on your own from the lot clawing stint. It comes from the uh, rooks layer of all places. Ahem, why did they dwell on whom? Misled whom? About what? What matters is that your efforts have brought us the black loam and we can expect a bountiful harvest as a result. Thank you. The bracelet, right? Um, yes, it's okay. Um, ooh, we can get into the room more. Confound Pyrus, they know nothing of killing, only killing, stealing our shovels to melt and forge into axes of all things. They're biting the hand that feeds them the mangy mongrels. I'd love to teach those curs a lesson in obedience myself. If I hadn't sworn to Stellan that I wouldn't fight no more. <clears throat> so I need you to bring back our farm tools and make sure those dogs reap what they've sown. Okay. Oh, okay.
Oh god, I'm gonna die. Heal! All you can do is heal. Oh god, what the fuck? Where'd you come from? No one invited you. Fucking leave. I'm only trying to fight the damn raiders, you bitch. You bitch, come back here. Great. Am I stunned? I can't move. Oh, yeah, I'm stunned. Bullshit. Oh my god. Oh, I'm being up, dude. Okay, I gotta be stunned. Nope, never mind. I'm fucking dead. Ugh. is reduced to zero, you are KO'd and withered and unable to perform any action. The next day you are left with two options, either return to it or put your current home point or wait for another PC to revive you using an action or spell such as rage. In an in instance, then you will return to the area. In addition to rendering your you temporary weaken after being raised KO or raised suffering a KO also suddenly damages the current people to gear on a piece of equipment to the extent drop the equipment yourself. Not forget to repair your gear regularly. Gear damage to KO is only experienced if you have reached level 10. KO and certain duty certain special duties will also result in damage. I don't know how many kills. I feel like we should do some side quests eventually. Okay, let's head back in. I think we just need to kill two more and then we can get out of here. Go back to this one. Fuck off. Shut up. You shit. Fuck off. Ah. I wonder what those sea dogs will try and steal when there's no harvest. I got your shit. Ah, oh, good to see the tools back. 
and in serviceable condition, which will be more than we can save of Severin when we get our hands on him. The wretch likely had a ro role in the theft. Spied him meeting the pirates in secret, I did. I couldn't care less if the rascal won't work, <clears throat> but when he consorts with cat purses that took our tools away, he crossed the line. Still one ought to know what sort of scalawag he's dealing with. Take word to him, would you? Okay. Go over here actually. Take the bridge. Report to Stellar. I think we might accept that quest along the way. If you're headed to Tiller's Rest, I have a favor to ask of you. The pirates have been away from sea for too long in their broken hearts. Turn to bloodshed for Solens, a full supply of medicine lasts barely a week. If you could buy a high potion and take it to Waidila, you may well save some lives. Hey, we have the potion already. Ha! Pirates making off of our tools. <laughs> Did well not to take matters into her own, his own hands. Last thing I need is blood on my crops. But I'll be damned if Severin thinks he can take us for fools. This treachery won't go unpunished. I've come to expect a great deal from you, lass, and you're, you've never once let me down. Yet, what I'd ask of you now goes beyond aught I've asked before. Would you hear my plea all, all, all the same? It eases my mind to hear, have your ear. You're no doubt familiar with that scoundrel Severin by now. Well, the Schemian scapegrace is added again. Since that letter came for him, he's been sulking about in that manner he does when he is up to no good. Now he's rounded up his robes and buggered off with nary a word to anyone. I've grown accustomed to his insolence, but something tells me this is different. It ain't exactly Damon, but when he when last I spoke, I had words with him. He didn't look defiant so much as hunted. I can't help thinking he's gone looking for trouble and found more than he wanted. So I was hoping you might hunt his sorry hide down and drag it back here before it's too late. Sure. The ungrateful little cur bites me every chance he gets, but it can't quite bring myself to cut him loose. I suppose he reminds me a bit of my younger self. Suffice it to say, I'd rather he didn't come to a sticky inn. As for how to find him, I try asking Gray Gurry Nude Nude at the Aetherite. She was the last one to see him. I dare say she'll be able to tell you where he was heading. Actually, I might go speak to her because I actually want to accept the quest up there and then I think we'll end off the episode 
There's a quest up here, right? I thought there was a side quest up here. No. Nothing passes through those gates except my notice. I saw the bruiser and his rabble set out for Widow Whisper Canyon not long ago, singing about drinking themselves stupid or cheeky saws said I should join them. I told him I'd rather shrivel off than sip whatever it was that had pickled their brains. If you find the idle swine, be sure and give them a cup round the ear for me, will you? <clears throat> Maybe it's down? Right now, not in there. Hello? Anyone? No? Okay then. Well then, I think I'm gonna end off the episode there. Um, it's not him, he's the orange guy. Oh, this person, oh my fucking god. Summer Forge Farm bears the cha charge of the Admiral's Settlement Initiative. We're rewarded handsomely to brave new forge. Yet, if we fail to fulfill our part of the bargain, the grant will be withdrawn. In spite of this, the wash of pirates elect to lays their days away. There is still time, we need only clear away the rocks and the breeze for the area to be deemed settled. If you are willing to help, you'll find a shovel outside that hut on the hillside. Okay, well then, we're gonna do that, and we're also gonna hopefully do the um, main scenario quest in the next episode. For now, I'm gonna end it there. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace!